This was the end of the United Kingdom of Israel for centuries. The prophets told the people there was something yet to come, someone greater than Israel had ever seen. Isaiah, Jeremiah, Ezekiel, they all told the story, and this is the way Daniel told it. Here is a story from the good book we know A story about a miracle that happened long ago We hope that you'll take courage when temptation you meet There's somebody watching you, calling you They held on to the will of God, so we're told They wouldn't bow They would not bow their knees to the idol made of gold They wouldn't burn They were protected by the fourth man in the fire They wouldn't bend, they wouldn't bow, they wouldn't now the prophet Daniel tells about three men who walked with God Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego before the wicked king they stood And the king commanded them bow and throne in the fiery furnace that day But the fire was so hot that the men were slain and forced them on their way Now when the three were cast in and the king rose up to witness this awful fate He began to tremble at what he saw and in astonished tones he spake Did we not cast three men bound into the midst that fire? Well, oh, I see four men unhurt, unbound, and walking down there. Their Shadrach, Meshach, Abednego, and the fiery coals they trod. And the form of the fourth man that I see is like the Son of God. They fell on the roof of God, so we are told. They will not bow the knees to the island, they will go. They will not bow the knees to the by the fourth man in the fire. They wouldn't bend, they wouldn't bow, they wouldn't burn. They would bend. They held on to the will of God, so we are told. They wouldn't bow. They would not bow their knees to the idol made of gold. They wouldn't burn. They were protected by the fourth man in the fire. They wouldn't bend. They wouldn't bow. They wouldn't burn. They wouldn't bend. They held 